we are doing our first little Disney pin magic mail live stream. So, uh, so we do have quite a few packages here today. So it's going to be really exciting because we, we've really been procrastinating all our pin mail. So you can see there here, let me, let me just show you guys because we have a bit of an overabundance of pin mail. So we have all this stuff on the table. Uh, this bag here, this is just filled with, a, a bunch of pins in this bag. And then behind us over here are some larger boxes that are per probably collections, uh, I'm assuming. But uh, yeah, so that, that's all the pins we got to open today. So we got quite quite a few packages to get through, which is why we're really excited. And hello, guys. Thank you for joining us. I hope you guys are excited for some pin mail. But uh, also in our room that we're still it's still getting it's still getting set up it's in here where we're trying to get our furnishing set up before we put all the pin boards up because uh, I don't want to put those up and decide we want to move furnishing now. around. But yeah, this is our new little room that we were going to do some videos in. Um, uh, but anyways, hello guys. And if you see a if you see an address, that's our PO box. Oh yeah, we got our PO box on here. If anyone needs to send us, uh, we our our UPS store <laughs> box is four five eight. Uh, yes. So Spins. you'll see a lot of that number yeah. everywhere. We know. Oh yes, the jasmine bear. Yes, that that is one of Shannon's favorite finds <laughs> yeah, that we, we got. Anyways, let's a lot see. Of this stuff is yeah, that, yeah. Speaking of, we did some thrifting today, and oh, we found oh I don't know if I'm gonna spoil the the video, huh? Yeah, you got it, 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 it was filled with uh, what were they? Their munchlings, or is it wishables? Yes, munch wishables. It was actually a combination of both, wasn't it? Yes. Anyway, here's our first package here. Oh, the Disney flares. Oh no, that's so sad to hear. You lost your two favorite pins. Got to get those locking oh. backs. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, locking backs might be a good investment going forward. But look at this inside of our first package. We actually have a sealed pack of the newer uh, Villains Mickey Head icons. Do I get to open it? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, just take take the scissors right there that I got conveniently Should placed for you. Unless you're, you're planning on saving it for uh, something else. So let's get it open. I'll open it. Oh. <laughs> you silly. You missed the, you missed the spot there. I tried there. to be nice about it. All That's right. Okay. Okay, let's see. Apart. Let's see what five villains we get. All right, and there they are, and very cool. So we got the Maleficent one in there. The Maleficent is definitely on the better end of the uh, the Mickey icons. We see a Cruella a lot on the boards, uh, so that one's not exciting. That one's, but these are, these three are pretty good. Are, I think they're all good, honestly. I mean, are there any bad ones? No, no. There's. I mean. No, they're all good. All right. Well, let's get these moved over. Uh, and then we got to open up our next box. And that, that one that's covered in a princess wrap there. <laughs> it's like a present. Yeah. So so that one is actually from uh, the UK. Someone from uh, Disney Paris. is. Uh, I, I bought a bunch of stuff from them. So that that's what's going to be in there. It's like they um, wrapped it. It looks like you'll need scissors for this package. But yeah, you can see through shipping the, uh, the, the wrapping paper didn't survive very much. Much, but uh it's still it, the, the effort was there yeah you I can he, yeah you could see that they wanted like, to make it a beautiful package there because my birthday's coming up kind of <laughs> ish right ish both of our birthdays. Oh, yeah. We, yeah, Shannon's, Shannon's got her Halloween birthday, and then mine is two weeks after that, so we got our birthday bash coming up. <laughs> I'm going to cut myself on live, right? That'd be a little awkward, You right? silly. You be careful with those scissors, and if you need some help, This one's it's like a small box, so it's hard to cut it open. Like, because they're... There we go. <laughs> All right, what do we have hiding in here? It is a box with a Ooh. bunch of Disney pins. I always treasure. love seeing, yeah, the little treasure box here. And it is some treasure. Look at that. There's a bunch of Snow White pins. They're all Snow White? Is it all Snow White? No, no. Oh, look at that. This is this is a really good pin because this is from one of the Disneyland Date Night Mystery Boxes, which is a fairly rare series. So it's a, yeah, see, it is. Disney, oh, wow. I didn't realize the edition size was so small. Look at that. Only 235 of these pins. That is such a tiny edition size. We definitely might need to do some cleaning our Disney pins. Oh, are they? They uh, yeah, little. Yeah, you uh, feel them. They're a little bit. Meh. They're a little bit meh. But it's okay. Yeah, but what is that hinge, Snow White? Is that some this is a nice looking pin. Look you at can that. Tell with this one. 
Oh, the aerial. Right, it's just a little bit. Yeah, just a little bit. Not too bad, though. Oh, this is a DVD real. release pen. Look at that. It's a 2009. It has a little ooh. spinner disc on the inside. But it kind of makes them like, ooh, they're ooh. so vintage. <laughs> yeah, they ooh. definitely do look like ooh, they've like got some age to them. Just, I don't know how they were stored and what causes Why? that. Like, but this one's not even old. Yeah, I, I see what you're saying there. What? This one's not old either. What? Oh, some more Snow White. Oh, oh nice ooh, look at that. A Mickey's Halloween party with Maleficent and Jafar and the Evil Queen. 2016. Aww. That's another limited edition. This one's 4,000. Oh. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Oh, score. Look at that. We got a Splash Mountain pin in this box. Oh, I think we saw Anything it. Splash Mountain is very some, high. Uh, the boards right uh magic boards. oh is that what the what it was i, I know you saw some like... uh some evil queen ones but uh yeah this one this one's 2004 Ooh, this is a cool one too. but it is a really nice evil queen pin oh i've seen that pin before snow white and the dwarfs yeah it's a unique one. Oh, an evil queen the evil oh yeah that's a newer open edition one i think what else is in here almost through the package i went to get and a buzz Lightyear. very cool all right um, did... Is there the last one to go with this? Oh, okay. There's Tinkerbell. Is that the is that a full set? Are we missing Peter Pan? Mm. Yeah, Peter. Peter was Wait. probably in that. Oh, there he is. Very cool. Okay, so we got a whole darling flying through the sky set. Is it Lounge Flight? It just says Disney on the back, so I'm actually not sure what series that is. Yeah. Anyway, all right. I guess you got to choose our next package now. The Snow White. You got you got to get some piles going. You got to get your keeper piles and the uh, the for trade piles. I already have. <laughs> I have this. I think I have two of them, but I kind of want it again. So. Oh, you want multiple because, of that Tinkerbell? Okay, but, but this is like kind of like a pin that like adds to the collection. You know, like it's kind of like an emblem, like a sparkle. Oh. You know. So like if you add a bunch, it's like ooh, like a sparkle. Yeah, your collectible board of the uh, the golden. Mm, okay, I have to look closer at all of these. So. I can't scoop. choose, but these ones for sure. I'm... You want to put your keepers on this thing so you could uh, kind of keep them separated? There's more. Don't keep tra lose track of them. There's more I want for sure, but these ones. Those are sure. those are the for sure ones. Okay, all right. Well, next box. Let's go ahead and see what we got hiding inside. You gotta figure out how to open the box first, huh? You don't, don't even know how to take a stab at it. I think it's right here. You gotta figure it out. Yeah, they, it looks like they taped up that one pretty well, so you <laughs> can't even hey, see the the corners of it. If the pins are safe, because sometimes we get packages and we're like, how did the pins even get here? <laughs> what? I think the mailman has gotten so Oh, yeah, we have definitely gotten so many packages where it's like a, a bubble mailer like this. <laughs> but the uh, the the pins didn't have any of their backing, so it was like a whole... He's probably like, ow! <laughs> Yeah, it was a whole spiky package. Yes, we are we are doing a live for the first time in a long time. I think we've only done one other thing when we we did some. All right, what? Oh yeah, yes, yeah. So, yeah. We had all these packages. I'm like, we we just gotta go live and do this. Okay, so we got some lanyards in the. Oh, it's a Star Wars one and a Pirates. And what's in our? I see a Pokemon pin standing on top. I don't see a backing on it though. Is everything yeah, else a, backed? There's some things that aren't backed. Oh, it's a uh, Absol, I think his name is. All right, keeper oh, pile right there. Look at the kitties. Oh my goodness, this oh. one's like a little. You guys. It's like my kitty cat. We're gonna watch Stitch again tomorrow. So oh. <laughs> we're yeah. Gonna watch a cat tomorrow. Yeah. If anyone doesn't have the context, yes, yeah, so our neighbor's cat Ooh, Stitch is coming over. That's a cool one. Yes, that's going on my Star Wars board right there. These are all cool. They go together. Oh, all the vinyl nations. Uh, if I don't have, I think I don't have it. I didn't. I want it. Too. You want it? That's going in the uh, the keeper pile over there. Another Pikachu. What is it? Twenty nineteen Washington D.C. You gotta keep Interesting. It. That's gotta be a Pokemon Go one, huh? We like white cats too. We gotta keep. I don't got no them. connection with a white cat, but if you just so... want to create a cat collection. Oh well, these are the same though, but I think one of them's yellow. Yeah, one of them's yellowed. Well, so now it's a yellow. yellow and a... But like a yeah, name. yeah. This one's white on the bottom. And this one's white on the top. Well, I guess one looked like it peed. <laughs> All right. So let's maybe see. we like the other one. I don't know. We'll have to see. I gotta get a, a pile going for some of the scrappers. You can see this one's not so bueno. Yeah, some of them. No good, no good. No good. This 
Oh yeah, <laughs> Mickey is not supposed to be orange like that. There's a Jake in the Neverland Pirate pin. That's a cool pin. All right, we got most of these guys cleaned up now. So Shannon, if you want to get the next box started, we can move on to our next box. Let's see. Easy way to tell on these Mickey Motion series if it's the real or the fake one. The real ones always have FAC numbers on the back, which you could see right there on this pin. Because this is another commonly scrapped series, but you gotta look for that FAC on the back. Ooh, what set is it? Oh, look at that. So this next package, it only had one little set, but it is a nice little one. You can see it's a Cinderella one. This is an old booster pack. I think it was released in maybe like 2009. You don't see those together a lot. I've seen some of them separate. Yeah, so you can see there's the Prince, Cindy, uh, Jack and Gus, and the uh, the, um, the evil stepmother and stepsisters. And then, great question. Yeah, so with the with the scrappers, basically, I have a popcorn bucket that I just throw them all in. Uh, and then anytime we go to the parks, because there's a lot of people who aren't very much into trading there, uh, and they only have their eBay lot pins with them. So we, we bring a, a board of uh, these for all the kids, so that way uh, if they don't have any of the yeah, the better pins. We don't, we have, don't to have to turn them away. We can be like, you can you can trade off of this board here. So it's nice to have for that scenario. Because <laughs> I always hate having to say no to it to anyone yeah. for, for trades. It's, it's always so sad. Yeah, and it, yeah. It's more more for the fun of it. But let's see what do we have in our next package here. And I also have some. I want to do some crafts with. <laughs> I think it'd be fun. TikTok coming soon. <laughs> yeah. If you guys have any fun ideas too. I'm making a list. Oh, that's a nice looking one there. It's uh, Sorcerer oh. Mickey and Maleficent, Heroes and Villains. That would be cool in my Villains collection. Very cool. Oh, yeah, the Pusheen Cats is what we got. I got a collection of little Pusheen Cats already. <laughs> so those are going to be added to it. We love cats. 20,000 leagues under the sea. And this, this, soda, this soda bottle series, I think, is really awesome. Remy. It's an older one, too. Remy, oh, Remy the Zoom Zoom. And uh, who's this? Mr. Toad, Heimlich. Pumpkin. Oh, a pumpkin one. Perfect, Perfect timing. Oh, he goes with Remy. Oh, there we go. We got some matching zooms. And what's in our last little bubble package here? Ooh. Yeah, Remy. Uh, uh, Remy is definitely a really cute looking as a zoom. Ooh, this is a cool one. Oh, we got more Halloween stuff. What is this? This is Jack and Haunted Mansion Holiday 2009 with a little dangle. Oh. This is cool. It's like the build-a-pin, right? Yes, that is one of the build-a-pins. So in case anyone was unaware, uh, Disney used to let you create your own pin. So what it is, this is, is a Magic Kingdom background and then these characters on top. Um, they should bring it back. Uh, yeah, you got to choose whatever characters you want to put on the background of the pin. I, I've heard that it was actually in Disney Springs is where that location was. I don't know how long they ago. Bring it, back it was probably next. like 10 or 15 years ago. And uh, I think it's where the, uh, the Marvel store is currently. They should bring it back for the next pin. Event. They that would be they nice. definitely oh. should. I I know that would definitely be a very very and hot location. If <laughs> oh yeah, that that'd be one activity they can add over yes, there. Yeah. All right. Okay, scoot those over. I, I might want to at least talk about that. Oh, you gotta add that for. It's kind of a cool pin. I don't like it. Honestly. Okay, what else we got hiding in here? We got Ziploc baggies. Oh, you know what? This is a complete train set. I remember buying this. So look at this. It is a Loungefly mystery box series, and this was the completed train. I love when they're completed and I don't have to open the mystery box. I know. Trying to complete like something like that through opening mystery boxes can definitely uh, oh <laughs> be a be a little uh, little expensive to do because uh, these mystery boxes... I know. It and it spe especially gets really tough as you are almost complete with it. Because okay. then you end up with so many duplicates. This one's the front. Who, how, which order does it go in? Does this, is this one next to the back? I this think Pua, Pua looks like he's the back because I don't see a hook on the back of and him. Uh, and then it. Fairy Godmother is the front. Is we'll just, we'll just wing. Maybe yeah, so anyway, yeah, there, there's the complete lounge flight train right there. Definitely very cool and some nice characters on there. So that's going on. Yay! The Keeper's Piles. All right. What are we going for next? Okay, let's go for the burrito. The burrito. Yeah, it is kind of interesting how it's all a little folded like that. The ways people package. It's fun to see. <laughs> yeah, there's always a, a nice variety. 
The most creative packaging wins a uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, wins a prize. Yeah, it always just reminds me of the one time we uh we got the most interesting package in the world. Which you you know what I'm referring to? Yes, that's what I'm referring to. We got they 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 put it in a bubble mailer, and inside the bubble mailer, they put the pins inside of a urine sample cup. I sure hope it was not used, but it, I guess it kept the pins well protected. Uh, this is so gross. Though. <laughs> that that was the uh, the all time winner. Do something to them, like. <laughs> okay. Yeah, but anyways, let's see. Oh yeah, they got some more interesting. What is that? That is a uh, tissues, cooking parchment paper. Yeah, oh no, it's tissue wrap. <gasps> oh, it's these. Oh, yes. <laughs> back to back train sets. What's the please, please, please for? I don't think it's complete, is it? Oh no, it is. This is the complete uh, train set of these dwarfs. I because I think I wasn't sure if they, it was complete or not because there's five pins in it. But I it's because some of the dwarfs, them. there's two of them uh, on the uh, the train set there. I think I have like one or two of these, and I've been waiting. Yeah, to get so the look rest. at this. So this is limited edition of fifteen hundred from two thousand seven. So we rarely see these. I will trade something else. But uh, look those. at that! <laughs> look at that! We got the complete set here today. Uh, yeah, we here. we found one or two of these at pen events before. For trade. <laughs> is that is that what you're <laughs> offering there? Please. You can have them. That's fine. We're, we'll add that to we'll the pile it. over here. Oh, Okay, anyways, let's see. We are going to our next box. He's like, I don't know, like, those are some pricey pins. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the, the, this dwarf... Uh, he told me, he's like, I've got some pins, I don't know. If you're yeah. like these. <laughs> yeah, I, I had a funny feeling uh, the, those were going to get taken from me, huh? Anyways, what do we got in here? I see lots of baggies. Ooh. Lots of baggies, lots of pins. It's like Christmas. Oh my gosh, a biohazard bag. <laughs> Uh, okay, uh, let's see. So I... Ooh, look at that! A Splash Mountain Pin! That's our second one today. Hiding in there. We don't see a lot of the nerd pins anymore. Nerd rocks! We see those all over the boards, too. Oh, there's two Fozzies. Two fo oh, that was that's kind of interesting. Yeah, these two Fozzies, they look slightly different colors. So then I, I flipped them over, and it looks mm -hmm. like they are from different years. So you can see they, they kind of transition from the uh, the old style logo on there to the the, the Mickey-backed mm -hmm. well, as they were making the Fozzies. So sometimes you'll see variations like that when uh, pins are released in different years. Mm -hmm. uh, but let's see. Yeah, this series is really cool. Unfortunately, I don't think this is an authentic one. Mm -hmm. But... Definitely a really cool pin. Khan and uh, Daisy is writing on him. Oh, this one's for me. Ooh. Oh, a big princess one with a castle. Oh, it's for my princess collection. Very cool. All right. What else is hiding in here? A jumbo uh, grumpy cup. I think I have this one, but I have to check. A, a tink I heart Tinkerbell. Size. Yeah, the, the size <laughs> difference is so crazy. Here, let me let me look at these. So this is a 2006, and this series is 2006 as well. Ooh. Interesting. I'll have Ooh. to uh, look into those. This one's really cool. Oh, that Tinkerbell. Did she move? She's no, little, she's just a little ballerina dancer. But yeah, that is definitely an interesting one. Do we have any Finding Nemo pins? We definitely own some Finding Nemo stuff, oh, I didn't but uh. I realize like there are two different names. Oh yeah, there's different poses of Tinkerbell in the Star Series mm -hmm. here. I'm trying to see if we we found any Nemos this today one. though. This one's. Ooh, this one's. I don't pretty. think yet. Not yet. No Nemos, no Probably Nemos no. today, but yeah, we, we still got quite a few boxes because we just have these ones on the table, and then there's a whole bag of uh stuff in there. Oh, this is a cool Halloween. Hello, Jacqueline. What is that? Oh, it's a Halloween goofy. Should we make a Halloween, like... Oh, a Halloween so section on our table here? Out. We're gonna have to pull it out later. You gotta separate the Halloween I stuff. I would say this is kind of Halloween. Yeah, no, no, right? this is definitely Halloween. We got yeah. bad boy Donald. Donald in his devil outfit. This one, should we do all Halloween? These could be earrings. <laughs> Do we have an? Uh, we, I do have an Instagram page. It is Nick's Pin Shop, so that's why we always have a crazy amount of pins. Can't keep them all. Only we were rich. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Guesses on what's in here. 
I don't even know what's in there. <laughs> it's like a mystery box every time. I think Mickey and Friends and a lanyard. It is a lanyard. Let's see who is on there, though. Kind of soft, no, you, you got a little already. sneak peek. I, I mean, I saw color. Oh, look at that. Pooh Bear. Okay, there's some cool okay, stuff on I'm here. Okay, so there is a California Maybe Adventure a Goofy. Ooh. Jasmine, the United States star. This goofy one's pretty cool. Although I see there was, there used to be a rubber piece on his uh, little no, ear hat there. Him too. But it's gone. Oh, and the Mickey one too. Wait, where's that bag? Uh, at least Pooh Bear. Pooh Bear has one of those rubberized pieces on there and it's a little honey pot. But it is still on there, which is which is good. Uh, Mickey has a pirate. That's pretty cool. And then Maybe Minnie, that. Minnie with her pom poms. Jiminy Cricket. Na no, not Jimmy. Just Jimmy. Jiminy. J Jimmy. I can't, I can't get my words out. <laughs> Jimmy. I don't know what I'm thinking. Anyways, uh, the Feast. Oh, Pluto from that series. That's a really nice series. Grumpy. And this is a really nice Beauty and the Beast. Look at that. Belle and the Beast. That's a really awesome pen. Flounder's a little mm -hmm. dirty there. Maybe you could like make oh, wait, your own wait. little hat or something. It's the same Goofy pin, but this one actually has that rubberized piece that was missing. Oh, a Disney Resort. One. There's Snow White, Mickey, Boo, Jasmine, and Belle, Tinkerbell. What does it say? It's all about me. Oh, I wonder if that's a two-pin set where they went together. And then uh, Minnie with uh, a wrench. <laughs> Uh, do, French, right? uh, do any Tron pins? Tron pins are actually on the rare side. Like, they don't have a whole lot of them out there. Uh, I, I would be surprised if we found any in our boxes today because I do not remember purchasing any at all recently. However, I did get one Tron pin while we were at the pin event. At the, uh, the Magic Happens event, I found a Tron helmet off the board that I chose as one of yeah. my, one of my pulls. It was actually a set from D23, and it was limited edition of 999, I think. I yeah, so it was kind of weird. Usually it's only Haunted Mansion stuff that they 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 make limited okay, edition of nine nine nine. You you want to break into your Christmas present there, your birthday present? There it is. All right, well, what you got a brown box. Why is it so squished? What happened to it? Yeah, well, it was shipped. To, it's had a long journey here. Is it wet outside? Did it rain? I don't know. Why does it feel like it got wet and dried up? Yeah. Uh oh! I hope uh, every. Doesn't feel like a box anymore. <laughs> All right. Well, hopefully. Uh... Was it a box? I mean. Well, yes. It started off as a box. Now it's a little crumpled the in the corners, it's but. Taped. It look like it. All right. Fingers crossed. Everything <laughs> made it here safely. Oh yeah, I see what you're saying now. All right. Well, hopefully everything made it here okay. Can I just open it? I guess. <laughs> All right, oh. wow. Oh man, they spent some time wrapping these pins. I mean, at least they're wrapped nicely. I do, them. okay, so I can see the cards and the cards do not look wet, at I least think. from here. Uh, so I think they, they should be, make, what'd you, what'd you go for? No, I'm gonna open them up. Oh, okay. <laughs> It's gonna take a lot of opening. Yeah, this is, this is gonna take a fat minute to uh, get through all these, but you can see a lot of these pins in here. These are Disneyland Paris stuff. Yeah, so I know, I know there's gonna be it's some for birthday. your. Yeah, there, there's yeah. definitely gonna be some some that are ending up in uh, Shannon's collection there. Um, Ooh, a lot. But yeah, lots of Disneyland Paris because this one came from France. The guys in France that I got these from. Yeah, he. Uh, I love Paris pins. They do pins so good. Yeah, they they always, oh wow look at this uh, the first pin out the package there this is a really awesome one to stitch they have so many really awesome stitch pins in paris but yeah here's him dressed up as jack jack sparrow and his little ducky companion there <laughs> he almost looks like is that supposed to be smee oh, I want this it definitely one. looks like a little smee and a group group cosmic mix volume one very cool all right i'll add that to your pile you got going over there the old hag Oh, this is an interesting two-pin set. I haven't seen this before. I love you, and I know Han Solo. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that, that, that's why you're disrespecting this pin it's here. Okay. And the 2023 spinner. We know what it is. It's okay. <laughs> yeah, not, nothing too exciting. Yeah, anytime there's years on pins, usually collectors don't like those ones as much. It's just like, I don't want to put the effort in right the now. The not-so-old hag pin. <laughs> Uh, huh, she's not very wrinkly on that one, huh? 
Yeah, she looks like a baby. Oh, this one's really awesome, though. It's a Chippendale one in front of Small World. We got, uh, where are they supposed to be? Uh, oh, I thought they were, I thought it was like the Royal Guard or something. I already have this one, otherwise I would so keep it. And this is Thumper, also known as Pan Pan, <laughs> which is, uh, Pan. yeah, that, that's what his name is in French, I guess. Or at least that's what Disneyland Paris calls him. Pascal, Pascal floating on the, uh, the lantern. Stitch, Stitch and another little ducky. Ooh, now I can use this one. Oh, you needed Tower of Terror pins, huh? All right, well, that is very convenient timing for this pin. Yeah, Let's add that over there. <laughs> Paris, Disney World are very strict on their trading there. They actually look and check and see what the pins are on. You know, it would actually be pretty nice if uh, they did that over here as well, because I can only imagine what the pin boards would look like. Yeah, it'd be, yeah, it'd be, it is this the same one? Fancy yeah, that's the, the same group. Just whatever. Yeah, but, uh, we hope to make it there one day. Go, go check out. I, I've heard it's only one pin board uh, they have Ooh, at Disneyland Paris. Nice but I'd be very curious to see what's on there. I wanna go. And another Tower of Terror key. So that's a duplicate. And that's the file. And from the Disney 100 series, there's Chippendale. Is this the, did they, they release this in the U.S. park as well? That's such a cool Pinocchio. Christia, welcome on in. <laughs> Thanks for jo joining the YouTube stream. Uh, and, oh, yeah, look at that. That is Pinocchio and Figaro on what looks to be his ride. I I'm, I'm like wonder, it does it. But so cool. Yeah, no, that's a really awesome pin there. Can they make that for, like, other rides too? <laughs> yeah, does it. Uh, oh, this one with, uh, Lucky. With his four-leaf clovers in the background. More Stitch. Oh, I didn't even realize that's a teacup. He's, he, he, got, he got a little too dizzy. He went a little too hard on the uh, the teacup ride. <laughs> What'd you find there? On this one's uh, Chip and Dale Haunted Mansion. Ooh, this is those, are, those are pretty awesome. The other Haunted Mansion one. But there's more Haunted Mansion. More Haunted Mansion. There are a few pin boards. There is a huge board at the main area at the beginning. Oh, okay, so there are multiple. I was thinking it was only one. Yeah, everybody tells me it's only one. Uh, but that's good to know. Anyway, another really awesome Haunted Mansion with Stitch and the uh, the singing statues. Yeah, I, like when they add the I like how he's got his ukulele on there. Yeah, no, they, they do so many really awesome pins in Disneyland in Paris. And there's another two-pin set. This one's Sebastian and, uh, and uh, so Flounder. And Chip and Dale, some autumn leaves. Oh, that is a really nice one. Very Halloween uh, style one. Jack in a spider web with a bat on top. That's really cool. Okay, this is a repeat of that Stitch one again. We got Groot, Groot making a run for it. And it is a 2023, but it is a nice looking 2023, I do gotta say. It's nice how they added the castle in the back. Mm. Another one of those. Got an Instagram friend that goes every year. Well, we are jealous of them every year. That That's a big trip. That's a long flight out there. Uh, here's this one of Donald and Daisy from the 100 series. A repeat. I knew you were going to want this one. Yes. Starla likes the 2023, yep. <laughs> uh, there was 10 cast members wearing pins. Yeah, okay, so one thing I don't know for sure, but I've heard that the uh, the cast members that wear pins in Disneyland Paris, I think they're their personal ones. Is, is that correct? I don't know if anyone knows, but... Oh, what? That's what I heard from somebody. I don't know if it's true or not, but... I got because I think that doesn't, like, Hong Kong and know them, they don't have... I, I don't know anything about trading in Hong Kong. This one's just big old Thor's hammer. It's pretty cool, though. I might like it. And is this another Stitch? Ooh. It is another Stitch. We got Cowboy Stitch right in on a goat. Oh, no, it's not a cowboy. Well, he's on a big thunder goat. I thought that was almost... I thought that was going to be dynamite in his mouth there, but... <laughs> That's pretty awesome. And they, they, they have so many awesome Stitch pins. Oh, another two pin set. I like the big ones. Oh, you got a big trip planned November and Disney World next year. Well, hope hopefully the the timing can work out because we'll be around. We're, we're we're always in and out of the park, so. I'm, not, I'm, I'm thinking about it. 
Yeah, th think about it. That's going in in the Shannon pile over there. Danny Cass, welcome on in from Chicago, the Windy City. We've only been in there for like 30 minutes. We had a layover in Chicago one time. And, uh, <laughs> this one's cool too. Oh my God. Why okay, what is this one though? Ooh, it's a Marie pin. Marie is always a really popular trader pin. And that one is Gonna be at Hollywood um, Studios on October 16th. This one's good. Well, that's good to know. We'll see if we can make it that day. Ooh. Although we we don't plan our days too far ahead of time. Because <laughs> uh, it's it's all based off of Shannon's outfits and her photos she needs. Well, no. It's all based off of the weather. And the like, weather, <laughs> yeah. If, if it's too hot out, too rainy out, we're, we're usually oh, little hermit good. crabs in our house here playing with our Disney pins. Another Pinocchio. Oh, it's the say yeah, it's the repeat of that that one on there. Oh my gosh, that would be such a perfect day to go to Mickey's Not So Scary, Friday the thirteenth. Oh man, I'm surprised that day one isn't sold out just just for that reason. That look, oh my gosh, that pin is almost the size of my hand. They literally just like are selling these pins out in Disney. I know, I can't believe Disney World or Disneyland doesn't have anything like this. Like, this is just a jumbo pin on a backer card that is marked as yellow. That doesn't sound like it'd be that expensive. Because I've heard pins in Paris are actually, like, decently cheaper than they are here in the U.S. What? Bro. Which I'm very surprised at with the... It kind of seems like their quality is higher. Yeah. <laughs> and is this our last one? We got a little tiny cutesy piglet. Oh. Oh, I saw that was the last one on the table. That's what I thought. Do you want to like? Do we do we save the Paris for later? Like, is this too many? Should I like just? I mean, some of them are duplicates. Oh, and then someone. I, oh, these the comments. Can, oh, oh, I didn't realize I can make the comments reappear. Oh yeah, look at all those. Uh, those there, but uh. Oh, oh, Shan's just picking out her favorites now. Look at this. There is a big dwarf one. All the dwarves, a nice jumbo one there. This one's good. But yeah, someone said that some of the cast members who wear lanyards in Paris, they, uh, they're they their personal ones and some of them aren't. So it's, it's kind of interesting how it would be a mix. You'd think, it'd, yeah, you'd think it'd be one or the other. Oh, yeah, the Phantom Manor, their haunted mansion. Yeah, Florida weather is no fun, especially right now. I might like this. Yeah, it's like it's like ninety five and sunny every day. There's a cutie. You just walk outside and instantly start dripping. This one, I'm because it's. What is this? This is oh, it's Stitch and Scrump is on there too as mermaids from Peter Pan. Yeah, I think we'll just have a few that'll open up. Do we have lots of pins? Uh, I don't think we have any lots of, but. I don't know. We we still got lots of packages to open up, and I never remember <laughs> what I bought. <laughs> oh yeah, you can see Chippendale. So their name in Paris is Ticket Tick and Tack. Oh yay! We have another Tower Terror I can use. What what you got here? Is this the? Uh... Oh, it's Goofy. That's a pretty cool one. Came with the luggage. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Oh, yeah, we are originally from California, so we used to be Disneyland locals. We'll kind of, we're from San Diego. Uh, so. What the heck? That's cool. But yeah, over the pandemic time frame, we moved over to Florida. And that's where we are today. Who's designing the pins over there? I know, I didn't even realize. This Stitch one is really awesome because of the little what? dangle pins. What would you go what at? Oh, another Jumbo Pooh Bears. I want I want to know what the uh, what these prices translate to rose rose pink. Yeah, who knows? <laughs> yeah, because I'm I'm pretty sure these things are like really cheap in Paris. Like this might only be like fifteen bucks or something. Groot. Groot. Put that in my section. Gotta put cutie poo there. Cutie poo. You can kind of see the uh, the Cheshire through the through the bubble wrap here. A nice little two pin set. You already saw that one. Oh, did we? Oh. <laughs> this one we didn't. Know. Marie. That's a really nice one. Her inside the heart. We got We're almost through. Almost, almost through. This is. Kind of. Yeah, I feel like we're like halfway through these. Uh, these. Oh, this is so pretty. I can't imagine how long it took to to but bubble wrap these. Yeah, dang. 
Dang, this person sat here for like... Yeah, no, they, uh, they took a minute, but everything has came here in this nice is... condition, despite the box was all, all, all torn up. But uh, the pins came in A-OK, -okay, which, is, which is the important part. Chloe, do we have any international park plans anytime soon? Hopefully. Hopefully. <laughs> I want to go to all of them someday. Yeah, one day we got to make it to each of the uh, the and Disney parks. I'm hoping maybe like, oh, this is a cool Disneyland Paris. Maybe one of them for like honeymoon. I don't know. Oh, I heard the hint. Right? <laughs> Wouldn't that be a good idea? But yeah, we get we do got a, a, a cross country uh, <laughs> Disney trip coming. <laughs> well, we'll be visiting uh, Disneyland here in the next couple of weeks to uh, go go to their uh, Oogie Boogie Bash. It will be my first Oogie Boogie Bash. No, it's not. No, wait. Okay, wait. No, make. No, I, I forgot they they changed the name to Oogie Boogie, right? This is cool. Cause I I went like oh wow. Right. Yeah, no, that's a nice one. Yeah, last time I went to one of Disney's Halloween parties, I think it was 2018. Because he, he didn't want to go last year, so I went with my friend, so now he's going. And you'll have to wait and see our costume. <laughs> You're going to like it. Wait, wait, is, is it a top secret? Our it's costume is secret, top secret? It's a secret, but he's the star of the I'm the star of the show is, all, is, is, is the only one. leak I guess I can reveal. It's gonna, it's, it's a fun yeah, this is gonna be me. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, okay, okay. Oh wait, ooh, oh, this one's a Tower of Terror one too. We're almost, we're almost through. Almost through with the. Uh... Hopefully, you guys like seeing this. Yeah, piece. this is a uh, repeat. Ooh. Oh, Tower of Terror! Trying to trying to add to that Tower of Terror collection. That's why we we're getting excited for these guys. Okay, so someone's got the conversion for us. So internet says green is eight ninety nine, orange is nine ninety nine, yellow eleven ninety nine, and pink is thirteen ninety nine. So I think a year, uh, uh, was it a euro? Is a I don't know what it is. It's it's roughly a dollar. So. <laughs> and this one here. Yeah. No, we we. <laughs> If it wasn't for our Instagram page, we wouldn't be able to do this, is all I gotta say. Yeah, because, uh, here's this one here of, um, Ooh, Lion see. King, and a nice Lion King jumbo. I definitely want this one. Oh, look at her. I love that This one is Cinderella. And I think I want this one, too. Yeah, Started collecting pins because you found the channel. Well, that, that's always very awesome to hear. Got a new collector in 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 the uh, in the Yay. world now. Very cool to hear. Okay, okay, and I like this one. What is this one? Oh, it's the Pinocchio keeping the bubble wrapped one. Ooh, a dollar is okay. ninety three cent euro, so it's a little bit less, but almost and the same. I go to Disneyland and spend a hundred bucks on pins in my life for. A <laughs> hundred bucks goes by super quick, though. Oh, that is like three of the little it's mystery like, boxes I know because I just bought them. <laughs> Yep, 100. 100 bucks right there, real quick. It adds up real quick. That that is for sure. Anyway, so I think we're we're. In the park, really. Yeah, we are. We're good for the uh, right. Disneyland Paris ones. Where so we, we, we still got the boxes sitting up here, and I got my bag somewhere over there that's just filled with packages. And then we also have these big boxes back there. Tiny box. Let's see what it's got But the good part is about pins is they will keep their value. So. Yes, that's why I like them. So, well, if you ever need an argument to tell them, <laughs> hey, you, you're not going to lose money on pins. That's why I don't feel as guilty when I buy them sometimes. <laughs> that's what, what is that? It's a ring. It's a <laughs> ring with a three-eyed fish. Wait, it's two. It's, it's oh, a it's Mickey a Mickey ring. ring. Oh, I like that. Been collecting pins since they started. You've been in the pin game wow. quite a while. Where's the thingy? Oh, man, we got a broken pin. California oh. or bust. <laughs> And it's just the bottom portion. It looks like there was supposed to be a slider oh uh, up top, but that is no longer on there. Oh, look at him and his little collar. Oh, he's got a bedazzled collar. Look at that dapper Pluto. Are they all out of like a, oh, they're all out of like a little barbecue. He's got barbecue. Oh, oh, yeah, look at that. There's yeah, barbecue, look. Mickey, and Pluto. Uh, this one of Goofy. Goofy. 
Lemonade. Oh, this is cool. Is that the full set? Is there anyone else hiding in there? What is this? Mm -hmm. This is not a pin. What the heck is this? It's just got a little loop on the back. It says Alex on it. Yeah, so it would have been a really awesome pin, but... uh weird Oh, you know what? This is probably fantasy because it doesn't say Disney on the back. I don't know. Kind of weird. I have this thing. But look at this California Adventure one of Pluto. That is a real big pin, too. What, what, what does it say? Okay, just California Adventure exclusive. You were gifted an annual pass. That is quite the gift right there. Well, Amy, that is real awesome to hear. Named Joe. And thank you guys for checking out the channel. What? Where does this go? Well, what is that? <laughs> is this like a? Pin? Is it an earring? Like what? What is that weird dangle thing? I feel like that's an earring thing. But what's the other part though? You put the earring, and that just dangles off your ear, right? And Anybody know? Mm -hmm. I don't know. It's a tie clip. Oh, this one's it's a tie clip. I, I definitely would not know what a tie clip looks the like. Birthstone? The birthstone? Uh, let's see. And then look. That one's cool. Oh, oh yeah. Goodness. Treasure Planet definitely does not get the love it deserves. Like, it, it's very surprising because everyone who who loves who likes Treasure Planet, they don't just like it. They love it. So, it, like, I'm surprised this thing doesn't acknowledge it more. Like, uh, oh, I don't know. Yeah, when we were at the thrift store the other day, you know what we found? Uh, there was a bag of plushie. What, you, you know where it is? I don't know. Yeah. It's in the hallway. We found, a, we found morph. It was a morph plush. It's a morph. Plush. I know. It, it, yeah, treasure planet stuff is so hard to find. It, it was, it was uh, yeah. very exciting to see that. Is all I gotta say. I was like, what? I've been after a little morph plush. So oh, someone, someone. Uh, let's see where it is. Uh, yeah, and some Disneyland pin trading videos are definitely coming soon. That is for sure. Okay. Yeah, and, and if you guys want us to show anything else in our videos. Yeah, like whatever kind of videos you guys want to see, you let us know. You never know, like, what you guys want to see, so. Yeah, because uh, not only do we have Disneyland videos planned, we are attending a uh, pin training event at the Hollywood yeah. Studio store, so we're hoping we can make a video uh, uh, during our, our uh, adventure over there. We're and sure we're definitely going to be... Go into the uh, the 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 Giardelli Hollywood store as well, so we could get our pin trader lights over there. Disney Studios store, yay! Uh, but let's see. But yeah, those Disneyland videos will probably be coming in like two weeks, I would imagine. Well, hopefully we can upload them sooner. But <laughs> uh, let's see. And. Oh yeah, oh yeah, these are a lot of like the newer open edition Ooh, boxes it kind of looks like. Halloween. Yeah, and if you yeah, someone someone's wondering how the heck do we get all these boxes? So a lot of these pins they they come out from uh people who reach out to us in most cases surprisingly. Uh cuz Shan will post on TikTok, "Oh, look at this pin collection we bought." And then someone will message her and be like, "Hey, I got a pin collection. You want to buy it?" Uh, and we and we get really fortunate yeah, in that course, sense. Yeah, and of course, I'm always on the hunt for uh, for good pin deals on uh, anywhere people sell pins, aka Facebook, aka eBay, aka Mercari. It's all all the top spots yeah, you got to keep your eyes on for. Yeah, you got to be as long as you know what fake pins look like, yes. you'll be okay. Uh, but if if you're just dabbling in the world of Disney pins, there there's a lot of them on eBay. So you got to be careful in that sense. <laughs> Oh, this one, this Rex one is really cool because his legs move back and forth, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, oh, and there's a Halloween uh, one right here. There's Halloween Tigger. Yeah, her legs move too. Just, yeah, Jesse's legs like, bent in half there. <laughs> oh, more Halloween. Because you guys do all the pin boards in Disneyland video. I did one of those one time and then someone told me I missed a bunch. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Uh, and this one here, you're, you're, yeah, because the, the problem is we're not Disneyland locals, so I know where most of them are, but I don't know where all the secret special hiding ones are. Yeah, we'll try to show them. We, we, I, I saw some special ones are out, like there's like a Halloween one. Oh, a Halloween board. All right, very cool. Yeah, just a lot, a lot of little smalls here. Okay, so we've cleared off the table of the packages that we had. Did you open that one over there, on that box? Oh, no. All right, well, I guess here's our next box then. Oh. Oh, we already got another package in the works. That was, this is part of the oh, oh, we still got more of these pen, pens. Look at this. A lot, a lot of the newer stuff, which is really cool. You can see there's Halloween. Uh, so, Liz, I would love to explain it to you. However, it's very complicated. Uh, because the reason behind that is because there's no universal trick to telling a, a real and a fake one. Uh, it's because there's D Disney, Disney. 
has done such a poor job of this. Uh, so it, it used to be a trick where, uh, like, on the back of these pins, you'll see the, the Mickey backings, if my camera will get in focus. They go off the edge. That used to be a trick. It's no longer a good one to tell if a pin is real or fake or not anymore because Disney official disney i bought them from the parks they have a nice nasty border on the back and the new hidden mickey waves that they've released they got really ugly borders too so that's something that you can't really watch out for anymore unfortunately so it, um, it really depends on the pin but i would just say like try to familiarize yourself with which pins are faked then that might help you yeah if, as long as you know the designs to watch out for that that that'd be your best uh best course of action i suppose like, in, like, uh yeah like this series this series is a is another common one that you might see faked this one is the authentic one the way i can tell is um there's a serial code on the back this little uh, screen printed fac number uh but i don't want to confuse anyone because not all authentic disney pins have a fac number like on the back like that um yeah that's it's, why it's so hard to it, it's it, it's a complicated you uh say one thing and then people will think that's Always. Yeah, so there's no universal trick. So just keep that in mind when you're when you're trying to go through oh, your Disney pins. Uh, and also, we are working on a real versus fake board. So anytime I have uh, a, a fake pin and I have the real one, uh, I keep them together. And oh. we're, we're trying to build a pin board. That way we can make a whole YouTube video on just kind of showing the differences you could kind of watch out for we in between the two series. Them. And it's nice to have the... Uh, the authentic and the fake next to each other so I can easily explain to you what I'm talking about when I when I say those kind of things. Uh, All right. What do we well, have? lots of Avengers, lots of Star Wars, well, lots of little guys in there. I, oh, where'd it go? There was one I wanted. Oh, no. Yeah, he's gone. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that that is something that Disney has done to start combating the, the, re, the fake pins is the... <laughs> It, it's kind of it's kind of frustrating because not all of the new pins have it, but I, as it stands of today, if it has those little, I don't have any of the new pins the here. Uh, yeah, the little jeweled Mickey diamond on the back of the pin. Yeah. It is authentic as of today. For now, yeah. They might try to fake those. Yeah, but anyways, I I think that's a great way to combat yeah. scrappers, if anything, because yeah. it, it costs more to produce them with that diamond on the back. Yeah, so uh, at least so so. Yeah. Yeah, so it might just only be the high-end fakes because there are high-end fakes as well. Uh, but anyways, here's our next box. <laughs> Let's see what we're going to have hiding in here. I want to know. Oh, you have to guess. What do you think's in here? Uh, is it a... I hope there's a pin book. I No, I don't remember. Oh, nope, no pin book. I am unfortunately wrong. It is all over the boards, and we got lots of... We got some pin burritos in there. Pin burritos! My favorite type of burritos right here. Well, yes. <laughs> Pin burritos would be my favorite burritos. Uh, here is... I see a lot of Wakanda stuff. Uh, what is it? What? We got some Thor pins. You know what this is? I know what these Aww. pins are now. So this is a bulk trade I did. Uh, so that's that's why we have a lot of uh, a lot of pins in here. They took one of my very high end pins. It was probably a profile or something like that. And instead, they are trading me a bunch of their small pins. So, uh, so we could uh, expand the collection instead of having one high-end one. We got like 50 small ones. That's also how you could get some pins, I guess. But yeah, th this one's really cool. The, uh, the dog little uh, nutcracker. I think that series is really awesome. And then Soli is in there as well. Okay. What, Mickey back fell off of somebody? You got an extra Mickey back in there? Fell off of one, I think. All right, who's in our next burrito? Well, I recognize one. Yeah, so there's the Wakanda ones, and then there's one of the uh, the where are they the uh, yeah the designer dolls is what I was trying to get at. <laughs> yeah, because these designer dolls, uh, they they're really nice pins. Like, look at this; it's a hinge one, but uh, I think they just made too many of them, and they weren't that popular. Because anytime I, I've noticed, anytime the 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 princess here doesn't actually look like how they looked on screen, yeah. they're not as popular. I didn't um, like it as much. So those ones went on a uh, super sale on Shop Disney at one point. They were trying to clear these out for $3 a piece, which was a steal of a deal. And so I picked up a bunch of those. because still in the warehouse. 
warehouse. Look how big. Yeah, they, I think they're still in the warehouse, actually. Yeah, they're not $3 in the warehouse, though. I think they're more expensive, yeah. but... uh. But yeah, those are those are really big pins. So three dollars when those are on sale, you always gotta check Shop Disney. That's always something that I always recommend for anyone who's looking to expand their collection or traders. Every once in a while, Shop Disney has crazy deals. And this series is really awesome. So there's the uh, character gift boxes. Oh, that's a repeat. And then there's the genie one. Very cool. A nice box there. More little tiny burritos. All right. Tiny ones. They're little tacos. Rolled tacos is what these are. <laughs> yeah, not quite as big, huh? Let's see what's inside. All right, let's see. There is buttercup. Not too many buttercup pins out there. That one's cool. No old Davy Crockett. Ooh, little not... Disney Junior. I don't know her name. Vampira. I might need this Mr. Smee still. Mr. Smee. I'm trying to get all of these. I like this one. Oh, you collect that series? Yeah, I like those. I got a couple in my books, actually. I have in my Tinkerbell. trader books. And I have... Because I have Tinkerbell and Hook at the moment, I'm pretty sure. I'm not sure if I have that one. But I might need Gotta add it to your, uh, what are they, Codfish Treasure Collection, as Peter Pan would say. Yep. <laughs> we met Peter Pan, and he called all of my pins yeah, because she she brought all her hook pins that day because we were not planning on meet, meeting Peter Pan. He just was, happened uh, to be there. Too, so, yeah. Yes, we are live X. Well, welcome on in. The, you got into pin training because of us. That that is that is very cool to hear. Uh, so if you're asking about our other jobs, we might have we're not we're we're not on, on the on the job today, but we are also dog sitters. Is is what we what we love to do. So uh, yeah, we we're. we're yeah, so we, we do a lot of pet sitting. We don't got any pets today. We're empty nesters, but uh, yeah, tomorrow tomorrow we're getting getting a doggy and a kitty cat over. So we're excited. We're 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 looking forward to having this them one over. Is really cool. Yeah, this is from the I think it was 2021's online pin training event. Uh, that, was, that was one of the pins they released for that. Yeah, I, I'm surprised they still had people buy a ticket for those. Uh, yeah, because uh, in 2021 there was no in person event, so it was all just. Uh, uh, the pins for sale and then the the sad part is most of them didn't sell out so then you were just able to buy them in the parks and did not need the to purchase that extra like hundred dollar ticket right. okay yeah there's some really cool ones in here and look at that there's a black and white mickey and walt that's a that's a really nice looking one and this one this is from the disneyland home series um what does it say it says there's always laughter at my home <laughs> Pretty cool, pretty cool. Amy, if you do want to follow me on Instagram, it is Nick's Pin Shop is where most of these guys you will usually end up. Do some more live streams. Noted. We will. I we definitely plan to start doing those a little bit more, especially when we get all these pin mail packages because I know it's, it's always fun going through our Disney pin mail. Um, let's let's see. see. Oh, there it is. Okay, let's scroll up. Is there a place in Disney World where collectors trade pins like Disneyland's Frontierland? So it's nowhere near as popular as... Um, as uh, Disney Land's Frontierland, but a lot of people meet in Hollywood Studios is uh, where they usually go. It's it's, it's in it's in yeah. There might be like one or two people sitting in there at a given moment. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, Splash a Mountain! We got another one for the Splash uh, Splash Pile. We actually got three Splash Mountain pins today, which is kind of surprising. But anyway, it, it is Sids, aka Antiques and Curios, in a Hollywood Studios that you might fi find other pin collectors sitting Disney, and no. trading with their their pin collection. Nemo. In the parks here in Disney World, but that is about the only spot. Did somebody want to see Nemo's? Uh, That's and all then... I got. This is all I got. And then Liz's collection is Little Mermaid and any Disney princess or Toy Story. Oh my God, I'll just take this yeah, Shannon, Shannon is right there with you. <laughs> uh, let's see, yeah, Nick. Do you have a small world collection? I've seen some. I'm Canadian, Just so it's hard to I find. Don't I don't collect small world, but I do have some small world pins. I don't know if they're well, in there here. Was a lot of them. I got. I... But they're like. Under yeah, under in my in my two thousand dollar mystery bag that Disney sold me, I got I got some uh, small world pins. Oh, yeah, there's one right here. Oh, there we go. There's a small world one. We got smile. Smile means happiness, friendship, and then the this one from Disneyland Paris. There's so many. I really uh, we gotta save that for a whole video in itself. The legendary Cars Land Disneyland pin purchase. 
<laughs> yeah, that happened three years ago, and I got 2,000 of them. That's that. That's all I got to leak about that. But uh, yeah, we, we I get that question so often that we definitely need to make it's a whole dedicated video on, on that whole just, story. Whenever people need that answer. We, we just, just send them link. the link. Here's the link. <laughs> Here's the whole all right let's see we'll so like <laughs> right? i'll put some some extra editing extra work into editing. that anyways so uh let's see ah, here oh we still got it there we go okay what is in here we got some teacups cool. the disney world train ww wdw mm -hmm. and that's a disneyland hidden mickey monsters university mm -hmm. all right oh yeah who, who is this guy is I don't Hocus even recognize. Oh, it's it Hocus is. Pocus. Okay. I think it is, right? Uh, that it's would something. make sense. I don't know where else it would be. It looks like that set, and it looks like him. Uh, looks Remy like is him. definitely on the harder side to find, especially because he's a popular character. So uh, it, it's 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 a little bit hard to come by Remy pins. Uh, Wait, you what? You lost my bag of packages, Miss. Is that what you just told me? All right. Well, now you guys get a preview of the uh, the mess that comes with unboxing all these pins. Yeah. There we go. There is. There is the uh, the mess of uh, packages there. Oh man. Anyway, there's the next one. Yeah, we're <laughs> working hard out here, huh, miss? Ugh. Well, some of these bags don't open. Uh, how many do you think you have? Oh, of the Carsland ones? So yeah, so that was three years ago that we started with over 2,000 of them. Today, we have roughly 600 of them. So we, we, um, so we do still have a nice amount, but... I saw you stretch to get that open. Uh, let's see. Sylvia, well, thank you for watching the videos. Let's see, actually design uh, still, uh, Disney pin stickers. There's okay. Those sound fun. Okay. I designed them myself and would love to send you guys some. Well, very cool. Um, anyways, where's... Oh, look at that. Look at what was hiding in this package. So that is a very massive jumbo pin that was released for... Uh, I think it was their 65th anniversary. But... Uh, yeah, that, it's a very nice jumbo. Look at that. That is literally the size of my hand. Somebody was just asking to see some lady in the trend. Well, that is, that is, yeah, that is a very nice one to show off there. But, uh, but yeah, if, if, if you do uh, want to send us something, um, our, okay, give me my package here. <laughs> There's our P.O. box if you ever needed it. I know it's a very ugly looking package, but, uh, yeah, I, I need to just add it to the description. <laughs> And and if you ever send us something, leave, leave us a note in it so I know who it came yeah, from. And wanna, other, yeah, like a, otherwise, I'm gonna think I bought it and it was just something I forgot about. Oh yeah, we gotta get a, a cork board going with uh, all our, our all our pins that we traded with people who watch the videos because that's all the trading we did with our cars pins that we had. It was all people who watched the videos and wanted one of the cars pins of their own because they knew we had so many of them. Ooh, but cool. look at this. This is a whole page of nightmare pins. Ooh. Oh my goodness, and the zero on there too. Okay, that's that's really awesome. And then shock lock and bear. Oh wait, I no. Like this one with the chain. Oh, oh yes, <laughs> that is such a such a silly random pin there. Oh, and then this one is kind of cool because it's like a tech deck pin, and the wheels actually move on that, so you can play with it the like guitars, a tech deck. I remember those coming out. Oh, that's actually not from that series. Oh, it's a different. No, nope, that's that's a rack pin. Is when Whoa. what that originally was. Why uh, did they make it again? <laughs> Oh, yeah, because he's on the front of it. Uh, and then that one... See, the, you see, this would be such a nice pin if they did not put a... They did not hide that little ear in the corner, Jack, just in front of the castle. Just put something in front Yeah, of just it. put a sticker on it. <laughs> Solve our problem there. Two flip-flops. The flip-flops. It's nice to have both sides because a lot of times we just get one side of the flip-flop. And uh, who just wants one side of a flip-flop? There's some cool ones in here. But, yeah, that, that was a cool little nightmare package. All right, you go pick our next one. Yay. Disney video games. I remember on Xbox, there was a uh, X the original Xbox. I had this Disney skating one that I loved. I, I played that, like, nonstop. Oh, my goodness. Well, that is quite the package there. Yeah, so there it, it does look to be mixed of uh, authentic and some scrappery-looking yeah. ones. Uh, yeah, like this one's not so good. This one's not so good. But then, yeah, you can see that. That's probably why. I bet you I got a really good deal on this. And that's why. Because I, I noticed there was authentic stuff mixed in. And you were like. All right. Oh, yeah. This is cool. I like this one. The Hakuna Matata. I'll keep that. Oh, look at this. In here, there's some uh, some Star Wars ones. I don't know if that one's good, actually. I don't know. 
There we go. With an X Wing. That, that's a really awesome pin. And then this one here of a TIE Fighter. Oh, I, I know. the good backings. Oh, the, the little need, goofy ears. They need to make these because these stay. Uh, yeah, I'm surprised. Like, yeah, if anyone has ever owned these in person, you'll know that these these Mickey backs, yeah. the, the, well, the goofy head backs, they stick on so much better than the uh, the oh, Mickey see. head ones that come uh, with all the pins. I'm kind of surprised they, they don't have uh, the Mickey heads where they can actually hold on tight like those guys do. Because you have to buy these in a special separate package. I don't know if they still sell them anymore. But they should, but yeah, they came in like a pack of like 10 or 20 or something like that. Oh gosh, where you could buy all these. Uh, and there was all a bunch of different really, really fun shapes. This would be like... There would be some there's a Baymax 2019. Yeah. yeah, there's a lot of really ugly stuff in here. But <laughs> cool. but yeah, there's, there's nice stuff mixed in. Yeah, okay. It's just hiding. <laughs> In there. Shannon inspired you to make t pin t-shirts. Well, those would be really cool to see. Ooh, pin t-shirts. I gotta, gotta get one with a Lightning McQueen profile on there. <laughs> uh, let's see. Do you have the Leon Stitch Small World Mystery Box pin by chance? I just learned about this series. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Well. Yeah. All. All the little. Uh. Uh. You know what? I should. Anytime we find the, because it's a faked pin that that we see fairly often. It's a little circle that says "Want to Trade" on it. Uh. I. Sh I should just get a hat full of those guys. <laughs> Uh, anyways, uh, for the Lilo and Stitch one, I don't think I own that one at the moment, sadly, but it, I do know which one you're talking about, so it's a pretty nice looking one. What? <laughs> well, you're breaking my table? Is that what you just told me? Oh, Shannon, what are you doing here? You be careful with those scissors. I know, I did get a steal of a deal on it. Our neighbor was having a garage sale and they had some tables. I'm like, oh, I need some tables. So now I got a table. And now she's scratching it up. Look. You keep my table nice, miss. Uh, let's see. Anyway, are you guys heading to Oogie Boogie this year? We are headed to Oogie Boogie. Uh, we are going to be going to the the one on September 19th. So not too much longer. What is that? That's in like 10 days or something like that. So it's coming up quick. Where do we get all of our pins? A lot of them come from people messaging us. And anywhere you might think you can buy pins is where I buy pins. I, buy, I get them on Facebook. I get them on... Uh, what are those? What are those? What is this? Crazy 8s made... Oh, it's a... Oh, it's a... Oh, it's Crazy 8s. What the heck? It's just a random card from that. That That's kind of cool. I didn't know they had a... a uh, Mater uh, from that series and uh, yeah, there's Monopoly money. <laughs> and Monopoly, oh, it's High School Musical Monopoly money. Oh, that is kind of interesting. Good <laughs> okay, good vibes. I yeah, like it. interesting. All right, well, we got some nice looking pins in there. All in the keepers. All of them. Even I do see some Edna. stuff that's not so good, but I do see some stuff that is definitely good. So uh, yeah. nice to see those. And what do we do with all the fake ones? Oh gosh, we got yeah, so we many of those guys. I, I yeah, I have <laughs> I have popcorn buckets that I just fill up with uh, all the ones that we get. Ooh. And then I anytime we get the authentic one, I, I pair them up so that way we. Um, I, I'm trying to build a board with real versus fake pins so I can easily explain to you guys uh, how, how I can how we can spot the difference. This would not match my Winnie the Pooh collection, though, but I like it. Oh, what? It, oh, oh! I didn't even realize there's Pooh Bear in there, huh? I I can barely even see it because yeah. the little constellation like it, Pooh it would, Bears. It would match my collection. And any big collection recently, uh, nothing too crazy, but in the boxes back there, there are some larger, uh, larger pin collections. And of course, uh, if you were here earlier, we got, we got a whole lot of Disneyland Paris pins in today. That, that was like a, a big, uh, big collection we got from someone who was in France, which is why they're all, uh, Paris stuff. Yeah, I'll put some good ones up here. Yeah, so now, now we just kind of got to filter through. Oh, just a tip on this series. A lot of people can't actually recognize that these are fake ones because it, it's a little bit on the better look inside of a, a fake one. But these are being scrapped. And you can see this one's the scrapper because it's so tiny. The bigger one is about one and a half of these guys. So it, it's a lot bigger than this little teeny tiny guy. Because that, that was an old figment mystery. But anyways, this one, this is a really nice lounge fly series of a bunch of princess castles. A little Cinderella. Oh, All the fanny packs, good ones, and then the bad ones are kind of down here. Sure yeah, I'm going to have to do a lot of sorting after this. <laughs> and yeah, Shannon's got a nice little pile going over there. What's in our box here? 
Star Wars. Oh, Star Wars. I might actually have this pin, though, because uh, we got a bunch of uh, this set from a... Hold on. Why is that upside? That is not supposed to be upside down. Either I have an error pin here or the sticker fell off and they put it back on upside down. Can you open what? that for me? This one? Yes, look. Yeah, well, it is upside down, isn't it? I don't... I don't know if that was an error, like when they first released it, this one just accidentally got stuck upside yeah. down. But look at that. Yoda and Dooku are flying in the sky. <laughs> the sticker does fall off sometimes. Yeah, so it is possible that it just got re-stickered upside down. But either way, I'll probably hold on to that pen because I always love goofy looking errors like that. Um, what the... Okay. Also oh, some other ones. Oh, Chew Chubby, Chubby, Chubby the Bird. Is it Chewy or is it Chubby? The, uh, the bird from Mickey and Minnie, Runaway Railway. I don't know if Shannon remembers me on TikTok, but I commented on your video about advice for a new pin collector on her Peter Pan one, and it's Jacob. That's, just, that's the whole name on YouTube, so Jacob. <laughs> Jacob oh, left yeah. a comment, but... Yeah, we gotta make a whole video about, like, advice. Because I think that'd be a cool YouTube video. Oh, how to start a Disney pin collection? Yeah, like... Well, just advice and like. Yeah, no, that that definitely be a good topic to cover in a video. Did they drop this in gum? Yes, I. <laughs> that's kind of weird. Yeah, it, it like bled onto the other side of this pen. You can see some of the some of the paint during production that happened. You mm. just found out that Disney World has a pin book in City Hall. That's actually good to know because they did not used to have one in there. I, mean, I, I the real puffles. Oh, yeah. So the puffles, the puffles, the fake ones have an ugly border. And these ones do not have an ugly border. So I think we are staring at some authentic puffles here. Right. That's exciting because Club Penguin is absurdly popular. Like, um, <laughs> yeah, everyone about my age, we all played Club Penguin when we were younger. So now that we're all grown up and have adult money. <laughs> <laughs> We spend that all on uh, all on our Club Penguin stuff. I love Club Penguin. Oh, oh, what is this yeah, pen? I showed you. I know. was busy doing something else, but oh my gosh, I'm I did not even know this was a series. Oh, Star Wars Weekends. I always love Star Wars Weekends pens. Those are always my favorite. Le five hundred Mace Windu and his lightsaber. I didn't even know the series existed, but now I have a new series yeah, to collect. Get the rest? I like yeah, Mace Windu, Battle Droid. I, you know what? I want to army build my Battle Droids. I think I have this one already, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna make an army of Battle Droids. So uh, I'll put that over into the uh, the pile that I'm gonna hang on to. This is another big pile. Chloe, you don't even know, man. I was the biggest Webkins collector. Ah, he just bought one. And still am. Okay. We went to the thrift store, and Shannon's always buying these big bundles of uh, plushies. And in one of the bags was a, a it was a Webkins with the code still attached, so I can still redeem it for the online digital version of that pet. He logs in, he's like, I still love my Webkins. I keep them in good condition. <laughs> uh, here's this one of uh, Cheshire Cat. Yeah, there, there's a whole lot of, lot of these little guys in baggies. There's some shady looking ones like this guy here. Um, <laughs> this is a goner. This is a goner? Oh, 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 that's why it's just a Mickey backing hiding in there. Oh, you're right. done, you're done. All right, yeah, oh, this is a cool one. You know, I, I don't think I ever ended up playing Neopets, so I, I don't know a whole lot about it. Is it, is it like basically like a, a, a Webkin's equivalent? It's similar, I think. I didn't play it either. But I'm a Loves and Dragon. Let's open the next one. It's in a box by the theater doors in the Walt Disney Presents. Oh, that is that is that is some good information to know. All right. Two more. Two more. Two more. What? Packages. That's all my packages. Nope. You just blowing through them over there. <laughs> all right. Well. Well, I guess we do have a whole table full of Disney pins now. <laughs> Okay, we got some cool stuff in here. This is some Mulan pins. Oh There's a Mushu for uh, winter 2019. I remember when this pin came out. Oh we got the pop-up books. And you gotta see if I have it. They had Neopets, PS2, and PSP games. Man, I would love it if Webkins had that. <laughs> that would have been so awesome. Uh, what is this? I'm assuming that's Mulan on the inside of this thing that I can't open up with one hand. Oh, and puzzle pieces! The Mulan puzzle pieces, I'm pretty sure, are harder to find, so. Those are nice. Those are nice to have. Uh, okay, so I 
guess we didn't open this. Oh, we didn't open it. Well, hmm, so is open not a whole lot of real exciting ones in there. Oh, you know what? There might be some no. some little <laughs> gems in there. Oh, wait, we we got a dirty grumpy mug. Another. And Rex, I think, was in an earlier package. Yep. What was your favorite so Webkin's mini game or arcade game? I loved I love the 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 uh, if we're not talking about the daily activity ones of course I love Wheel of Wow and uh, the uh, oh you know what the uh, the the curio shop that that was my favorite was so cool. going in the uh, curio shop in the mine Look at it. there was also like a uh, I'm gonna keep this. a sledding polar bear I remember I think I tried getting a high score of the day one time on that and I came so close. There's a Lilo to go with the other one. Yeah, the gem hunting thing. So uh, I, I think I have two Ooh. two Webkins Crown of Wonders. He dirty. Yeah, anyone who, who plays Webkins know I, <laughs> now knows I played that a lot. <laughs> no, did you look? I didn't look in detail. It's dirty. Yeah, it's getting a little crusty looking. Oh, yeah, you can see it on the back. Oh, it's kinda, I, I don't know what causes that, but... Oh, an old Geppetto one. And did you see the figure? Figment, what's wrong with Figment? No, I'll show you. Oh, no, it's a good Figment. Yeah, Figment and his little cast member name tag. All right, one more baggie. One more baggie. Hopefully it's a good one. It's bad, though. Then we got to open up the boxes that are back there that we actually need to open up anyway. No. Well, one of them I, we can save for its own separate video, but I don't know what that, that box over there is, so we can at minimum peek. Peek and we can we can we can tease the next video that we, we gotta do. Yeah. We can peek inside. Well smile if you ever see us again. Definitely don't be too nervous and come say hi. Yeah, a lot of people we say hi to, it's fun. And and I usually try and carry a a pinfolio on us, so yeah. if so if you got trader pins, we could always make some trades. Some but with the little cronk vehicle, this one's really nice of a wall. I think this one is it limited. No, it's, not, it's actually not limited edition. I thought it was. I I had a similar one that was limited you have edition to before. Keep this for your birthday I gotta hang on to it for my birthday. Yeah. All right. If there's another one, you have to wear them as earrings. I don't make the rules. I don't have to because mine's on Halloween, so it's just weird. <laughs> gotta gotta get some pumpkin earrings instead. There's oh, there's the Lilo cart. I need that one. Very too. cool. Very cool. There you go. In an old Walmart pin book. A Walmart pin book, what does that look like? I guess we can just uh, jump them Did out Walmart right sell pin books? Alright, we got little bundles, it looks like. There's uh, Elsa and her horse, a Spider Man web slinger. Hey, this one's really awesome the donut, donut Mickey icon. Can I eat the Elsa? Ooh, the pirate. Pirate Queen. Oh, big hero puzzle! Uh, let's see. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know Walmart had employee pins, but that, yeah, that's a perfect use for it if you if you already got one of those for your uh, employee pins over there. When I went to Pin HQ. Well, thank you for uh, heading over to Pin HQ and checking out our board that we have over there. Yeah, that's where some of these pins uh, will end up that we don't end up keeping or trading. This one comes with we got a, a little booth patch, in there. right? Patch. Oh yeah, yeah, that's right. Uh, this Dole Whip pin came in a little two pin set. It was a pin and a patch. Next. All right, next little baggie. Ooh, Princess Dory, we do all of the above. So we, we hang on to the ones that we love and then all the other ones go on to either. They'll this? head to a, our pin HQ board or our trader books. We and we try and go to most of the, uh, the pin events that happen every month here in Orlando. Like there's one this weekend, which we will be stopping into. Ooh. I like the big names. We got Tata for now, Tigger, some Up Ones, the Trooper. What is that? There's Belle from the Beauty and the Beast Mystery. Oh, and need, look at I that. Need, need it's it. a stained glass rose. It's so pretty. Very cool. What an event. So the one that's happening this weekend, it is held by Disney, is, is held by a, a Pyro Guy Pins uh, is his username. It's also the Facebook group. Club 34 Pin Trading, I think is what it's called. Well, that's the villain that's at Oogie Boogie now. Oh, yeah, I don't recall his name. But, but big hero puzzle piece. Uh, we got we got a couple of those going so far. Here's uh, here's the Baymax. So Honey Lemon. 
<laughs> oh yeah, the the tiki guy from the fiftieth anniversary <laughs> mystery box. Yeah, not a whole lot of people uh, know who that is, and there's a lot of them Ooh, out there. So sparkly. We, uh, we we do find those guys a lot. Oh yeah, hopefully, hopefully we'll catch you there. Okay, we'll we'll probably be going in. I don't know. Uh, right. Early afternoon time frame is what I would usually imagine. <laughs> All right, that was that was some real hard work, huh, Miss? Oh man, yeah, I gotta stretch your back out now. <laughs> All right, let me set let, let me set this down, and, and then I gotta investigate what our other boxes are. Uh, there we go. Okay, let me because I gotta preview what these boxes are, Shannon. Should I keep? I gotta know uh, if these are their own video worthy. Should I keep this? Or if I should just quickly go through this? Um. Anyways. I think I want that. You want that one? Yeah. Okay, let me peek in these guys. When am I going to find these again? What pins are you? The Paris pins. Oh, the Paris ones. When are you going to see those again? Look at these little you go hard to ones. What? How did I just forget about this box? Okay, this is a pin collection. And there's a, uh, well, it's a low-end one, but there's just a profile sitting on top. <laughs> That's what I'm like, how did I forget about that? Okay, so maybe that's its own video, uh, and let me, let me peek over what's in this box here. Yeah, uh, this one, ooh, what are these? This is more of the, the packages where it's like mixed, it looks like it's half strappers and half authentic stuff, so I probably got a good deal on them. But this is not its own video worthy, so we can, we can open these guys. It's overflowing. Yeah, we, we got like no more room on the table. This would be the last little, the big Yeah, this is, this is the, uh, the grand finale of the, of the live that will be opening up tonight. And then I got a lot of cleaning up to do in this room because, uh, there's a lot of packaging material just on the floor now. Anyways, uh, let, let me see if I missed any, this any. This is not just like from a week. This is like yeah, this, this is this, <laughs> yeah, this is some piling up that we, we uh. We haven't had time to open them, so they've been. Yeah, because we try and save them to do with videos and stuff. Is uh, let's see. Okay, um, very cool. Okay. Oh, you just want it. <laughs> well, do, well, yeah. Do you have a box that's still together? All right, this one here. Okay. Yeah. No. No. We can. You want to do that? I gotta set this down. I need two hands for this operation. We gotta clean up the table now because there is no more room on here. Very lightly, some of them. Yeah, some of these guys off the way, so we got some table room once again. My oh my, we got we got quite a few Disney pins again. All right. There okay, you that's enough, right? Okay, that's a heavy box. All right. All right, there we go. Now we got some space to open up our next packages. Oh, you want me to go on that side of the table? Anyways, you guys can get a preview of the mess that happens every time we uh we open up pin mail. <laughs> uh, all right. So what we got going on over here? Yeah, you can see. Yeah, you know, like. Mm, not so exciting. Oh, but yeah, this one here. This is one of the more exciting pins in there. So Disney doesn't do a lot of crossovers, but here is an old one of uh, Minnie Mouse dressed as Cinderella, which is really nice. I, I think we traded for this one at one of the events before. Uh, someone else who had her. Um, you have this one, right, Shannon? I think so. Yeah, I think I think I think I remember trading for that one at like a twenty-five dollar value or something. So it's a pretty solid pin. Oh, and here's another one of the bottle caps that uh that we got earlier. Oh my gosh, do we have this yet? Oh, that is a really nice one. We might have to add that to the wedding pin board. Yay! Very cool. Another one to add to the pile over here. That's so pretty. I want that one. Jasmine. It's an old heavy waffle back. Very cool. And Darth Tater. Darth Tater. Uh, that's, that's such Can an awesome one. Can we bring this to the Tater um, shop? The Tater? What is the Tater shop? Oh, I know what you're There's talking about now. Restaurant, yeah, Mr. Potato Head <laughs> restaurant somewhere in Orlando. I want this one too. And we haven't been to. He's, I I'm just going to walk in with like my hat full of all that. The, yeah, we have to I, I think I own like two or three of this Potato Head already. We have to be extra and wear a bunch of potato. <laughs> <laughs> the, the biggest Potato Head fans. Weird potato. Walking <laughs> in. Yeah, some not so look, good looking stuff. These ones are good. Oh, and old Cleo. Um, I think I have this one. 
Think these are yeah, Cleo is a popular character, a little little fish, and he's in. This is an old waffle back one. Anytime that it has like this waffle backing, it's early two thousands, and they they don't have a the year all the time on them. Next. Uh, let's see, a little thumper. What's this? Goofy pirate, Goofy. Anyone named Mary? <laughs> Mary, I oh you know oh. I, I was about to say we've never found our names on there, but I, I remember I actually have a pin with my name on it that we found Captain one time. Name. Oh, this is a cool Ursula. Ooh, nice little full body Should Ursula pin. An old waffle bag. A lot of old waffle bags in here. Blues? Look, it's another one of the Tiggers. Rabbit. We just got one of these like last week, I think. Yeah, it's I pretty cool. It. It's an old Disney store pin. Ooh. Ooh, oh, yeah, this is from a Nightmare Before Christmas mystery box of all the random monsters. Random. And a Cinderella spinner. Ooh, Animation it's Studios. Oh, it's the fake version. Oh yeah, this is the yeah the not so not so good version. This one I can tell because the paint dips in when it's not supposed to. Uh, yeah, Disney does not make hardly any soft enamel pins like that. So if you see the paint dipping down and like all over the pin, that's that's a sign it's not the not the best one there. I haven't seen this one before. <clears throat> what is that? T for theme parks, and it is an official one. I thought it was fantasy at first because that's so random looking. I wonder if it spells out something. It kind of, yeah. I don't know what it would spell out though. Maybe it could be a Tinkerbell series, yeah. And Snow White. Oh, Christy is after the Peter Pan lunchbox series. Yeah, the lunchboxes are, are really nice he ones. Burnt. <laughs> he is burnt. He went out in Florida without sunscreen. Yep. That was me the other day. Uh, what is the best pin y'all have ever found on the boards at the parks? Okay, so I know offhand which one it is because I will at the time is it the Ariel? It, It's the Ariel sister It's the so uh, I there was just one of them out here there anyway So the Ariel hidden Mickey the Ariel sister hidden Mickey series there uh, so this is this series is commonly fake. The one I have in my hand is fake uh, I can tell because the uh, her color is not supposed to be that weird ugly green color anyways so this series uh the completer in the set it is with the green shell that is the rarest hidden mickey out there uh and also one of the most valuable ones so i think it was in like 2018 or 2019 i found that one on the pin board uh and I, I i got rid of it at like a 40 dollar value i'm pretty sure uh but that and i have never seen it since and that, that was almost like four that was like four years ago and that's saying something with how many pins that we we normally buy um anyways that that hidden mickey now is uh going for multi hundred dollars and if you want to buy one no one even has it for sale so it's like super super hard to come across what'd you find oh my goodness look at this pin so this is an atlantis one no this is this is a really high-end one no, like really high, but like this is probably like a four fifty dollar pen, I would imagine. The grapes are pink. Oh, <laughs> the grapes are pink. Yeah, no, no, no. Uh, this one, this one is a berry series. It looks like it's not that. This, oh, it's a completer pen. That's probably why we're not used to seeing it. But this is probably a more rare hidden Mickey. It looks like it's from that same series as the the purple grapes that are on every pin board. But that that's pretty cool that we found that. Ooh, look at this one. Too loose. Now look, okay, so we got this one, there's... Ooh, look at that. I love this pin. It's Pooh Bear bench pressing a candy cane. Oh, we need that. That is such an awesome pin. I, I, I know we've seen it before. I don't remember if we kept the one that we had. So uh, add it to the pile just in case. We'll have to verify later if we already have it or not. World's best dad. We got this thingy, some princesses, and a doghouse and this. And, and Christopher Robin, that's a big pin. Mm -hmm. Look at him. That's a nice full body Christopher. Look, watch what you can do. Oh, you're gonna put the guitar over him. Oh my gosh, no, we <laughs> can, we can, we gotta put those together just just to do that. You can put that on the board like that. <laughs> that is too funny. All right, let's oh, see. Okay, next one. Next bag, and yeah, there's there's a lot of bags in this bag in this box. Where where was this baggie number eight? They got it marked as. Oh, here's the grapes that we were talking about from that set. Yeah, the, these grapes are not the good ones. Mm, I don't 
Oh, little splash, Mickey. Yeah, yeah. I, I don't have confidence. Oh, just, yeah, that is not an authentic I just one. Like it. I just like it. <laughs> There's the mummy from that Nightmare Monster series. The blue fairy. And she's got a little dangle charm on the top of her wand. Mm. Figaro! Mm. This one's good. There's another Nightmare uh, mystery box. <laughs> it's the Easter Bunny. Mm. It's kind of funny how they included that with uh, all the other monsters. And the Easter Bunny mm. gets lumped in there. Little piglet. She looks sick. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Ariel. Yeah, that is not a not okay, an authentic so Ariel. I can tell you that. Bad box. Yeah, there's a couple cool Bird. ones in there. Bag. All right, next baggie. Okay. This there's Tigger, good. Zazu. Oh, Grumpies. <laughs> Getting angry at golf. That's gonna be sheepy playing. That's gonna be you playing mini golf. <laughs> oh, speaking of mini golf, we need to go use our pass because we upgraded our uh, annual passes so we can play the uh, the mini golf courses uh, that they have here in Disney World that we have yet to visit so far. And oh, I'm gonna save that for <laughs> for when we go there. I got a funny feeling that's gonna be you if I start winning. No. Oh, I know it already. This is a cool one. Oh, we could have kept this for our clown collection when we had it. No, I, I never got rid of those pins. You decided I'm not going to collect clowns anymore, but I put them in a box somewhere. I still have all of them, yeah. So that can go to my clown collection. Good. <laughs> Look, some oh, more dwarves. Why is he he so is red? very tan. He's, but I, he's, no, yeah, he's red. He's real, though, right? <laughs> It looks like it. I don't know why he would be that I think dark. They make him real. I think he's sneezy, right? So. Oh, that could be just, a possibility. He's red. I don't know. I haven't yeah, seen the movie in a long time, so I don't know if he gets red during when he's sneezy or something. But yeah, the, it's, the skin tone looks off, but he, he the like weight that. feels. Oh, that's that's another easy telltale. Uh, that's pretty a uh, pretty universal trick is the weight of the pen. If it feels like it's really light, usually it's it's not a good one. More dwarfs. What is the snail from, though? That's Disney. Yeah, it's Disney. Like, I, don't, I don't remember a snail being in Fantasia. I, I could only think it Whenever could be from, like, a parade or something. If I don't know what it's from, it's from Fantasia. Just, <laughs> just the, the go-to for random characters. I mean, yeah. <laughs> There's so many random There's characters. There's Snow White. This oh, we were wondering that. Okay, so if only the water parks had pin trading, though. We oh, were wondering don't. if they had pin trading, because, yeah, with, with that mini golf thing, it, it gave us water parks, too. That's why we upgraded. So we were kind of having our fingers crossed that that was a, a thing. They, they'd have a, at so least maybe one board in the water parks. But it sounds like they do not, which is kind of sad. Why not? Anyway, there so is Marie. Cute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of really nice dwarf pins that have ended up in these little baggies here. Right, how many more and bags? this Pooh Bear, it is a hinge pin, but I might need Shannon's help to open that up. Two more bags. We got two more of these bags. Oh, this is one of my favorite Yoda pins. Judge me by my size, do you? What is this one? Let's find out. Who is it? What, what does it look like on the inside? Is this his butt on the other side? It is. I want it. That, that's a really awesome Pooh Bear. Is, is it a musical one? The know. snail is a sea snail from The Little Mermaid. Oh, well, that is good to know. I'm, I'm glad you knew what that one was. Where'd he go? Um, I could not... Oh, here he is. I found it. He's from The Little Mermaid? I like how tiny he is. Yeah, it's a nice little tiny pin. Oh, I want to see add into the basket. I just, wanna, I just wanna look at what... Turbo is <laughs> DreamWorks. I don't think it's Turbo. I mean... Ah! Well... I mean, now that you mention it, though, it kind of it definitely does uh, remind me of them. But look at this. So this is a nice Disney dog series, Good Georgette from uh, Oliver and Company. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah, Winnie the Pooh, Pooh and Fa oh, you know what? Look, Shannon, this is another one from that series with Tinkerbell. Oh, it says why with it Pooh and Family. The what the heck it's yeah, so now we have T and Y. We're not getting well, <laughs> we'll put that over I here in case. One word, toy. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, I guess that's a possibility. Then there's Graduate Pooh Bear. Ariel, Ariel and Eric. This is from the um, Musical Moment series. Kiss the Girl. Got that one again. And then she looks 
scary. Your oh, she looks. Oh, what happened to her eyeballs? They are just. That's for your collection. This is for my collection. It Let me see like if I could get it in some better lighting so you guys can really see. She looks like a demon, like evil witch. She looks possessed. Come on. It's because they couldn't do the details. Yeah, anyways, you can just see she's got black circles for eyeballs, which is kind of <laughs> weird because I've had this pin before and I definitely do not remember her having some little demon eyes like that. Did somebody, like, put black circles? <laughs> There's one more bag. All right, we got our final baggie. Hopefully it's a good one. Yeah, hopefully it's not filled it's with the... Uh, it's number one. It better be. Oh, it's looks Finish us out with a bang. Can we see her? Oh, this is... Yeah, this one. Your go-to Fantasia. She is actually from Fantasia. A yeah, little girl. Like, it's Maybe it spells out birthday. That is definitely a possibility. Mm. That It's like, it's like what, what game show is that? <laughs> Gotta fill out the... Did I miss all these? I'm just like sitting yeah, it's kind of interesting. I haven't seen that uh, series right. before. Oh, the Stitch one. This is one of the cool little Tokyo Disney prize pins. I love Disney. Prize. All right. Ooh, Pooh Bear. Pooh Bear sitting right on top. Nice little poo. Ooh, this is a good Ooh, one. Ooh, look at that. Anastasia and Drizella. That's definitely a more unique one. Let me guys show them our rare Disney pin from 2001. Like, oh, it's a surprise pin. Limited edition of 1,000. That's a really nice pin of them, actually. You know, you know, you don't see too many of uh, those characters. Another bottle cap. It's Snow White. I love this pen. Hey. <laughs> and the, the rubberized Pooh Bear. I remember you were trying to get one of the rubberized hey. from somewhere. Where was it? From Hello, Carmen. And welcome on in. From Pin HQ. Now I, can, now I get it. And this one here. Uh, Belle. Boomba. And what is the? Oh, there's another one. Okay, so it's not birthdays because it's got W. Is it Disney Worldy? Disney Worldy. <laughs> Because hmm. we had Tinkerbell, we got Y and W. Uh, that that's kind of I have no idea what that Walt series Disney. is. Walt, Di I, that's definitely what it's got to be, huh? Walt, Di that's a big set though. It's got to be Walt. Disney, that's a right? big set. Yes, there what else has a Y? I, I w guess we'll, we'll we'll start collecting that set because there <laughs> there's there's a lot of them, but I've never seen them before. No, but... we're never getting <laughs> we're never getting any more of those. <laughs> This is a cool one. Oh, Cinderella one. Ooh, do I want it? Princess Dory's got the rubber Santa Tigger oh, and so Pooh, and I think Mickey as well. Yeah, look, they could go together. Look at you this could get the table. whole alphabet, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Walt Disney is definitely definitely what that's got to spell out, but that, that's quite a big set. Yeah, but yeah, it looks like we only found three of those uh, pins out of, the, out of those little baggies we got there. Hello, Sage. Welcome on in. All right. Well, very cool. We got, we got, it is definitely pin heaven on this table here. Lots, lots of pins today. Lots of messes we've made uh, with, uh, with our packages. And we even got a couple more pin boxes uh, in the, in the corners over there that are pin collections. We got to save for future videos. But uh, anyways, uh, thank you guys for joining our little live stream. So uh, we, we, this is kind of like our first live we've done. So I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to leave us a like so we know. And we can definitely do more of those anytime we get our pin packages in. We can start doing lives when we do that. Hang out with you guys. Yeah, um, it was fun. Well, epic journeys. I'm glad you enjoy the videos. Uh, yeah, we, 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 we got our Disneyland trip coming up. So we, we got some yeah. fun Disneyland videos planned. And then hopefully we'll have this room ready. Yeah, we got, we got to continue working on our room over here. We got to fill it all with uh, pin we boards and other decorations. Because right now, it, yeah, it, it's a little sad looking in here. <laughs> There's like but, nothing uh, back there. Uh, but yeah, anyways, I hope you guys really enjoyed. Uh, other than that, that's all we really had planned for today. But Brooklyn, well, th thanks for jumping in for the last couple seconds yeah. here. Thanks for for talking with us. It was fun. Have yeah, well, to we, talk we with definitely want to try going live more often. We might even, I, I don't know, we might try going live in the park sometimes. I know she doesn't like going it live in it's, the park yeah, because it's just uh, she, she gets a little nervous because we got to sit there and get some photos in. Don't want to do that. It Have was, you guys sit there hot. all this live? That's the main thing. And yeah, over here it's it's I'm not like, it's not like, very I fun need when one it's hand hot. With my fan, you know, I don't have. Anyways, fan for the camera. yeah, just, yes. Thank you guys for joining in tonight. Other than that, that's really gonna be all. So, thank you all once again, and hopefully we'll we'll be able to catch you guys soon. Have a magical day.